There's just as many challenges getting sheep out of containment as there is when you bring them in. Uh, the main issues that they're facing is going from a very dry diet suddenly to a wet diet which is high in fermentable carbohydrates and protein and quite low in concentrations of minerals. The sort of symptoms that you might expect to see in sheep when they first get out into the paddock and onto green feed are scouring, um, you, might, you might see some weight loss, some calcium deficiency especially in ewes in late pregnancy, uh, nitrate toxicity if they're going on to grazing cereals, especially oats, and also there's a reasonable risk of enterotoxemia. So the main focus should be on preventing any of these issues, so ensuring that the ewes are vaccinated four to six weeks prior to leaving containment. Also, when you're letting sheep out of containment, make sure that you do it late in the day and provide them with high quality hay for at least 24, 48 hours before you let them out to ensure that they've got gut fill and they're not going out there hungry. You can put some straw or some hay out there with them, but it's unlikely that they'll find that very attractive, especially if they haven't been out grazing green feed for at least four to six weeks. So prevention is the main aim and uh, to try and smooth out that transition from a dry to a wet diet. <laughs>